Alrighty then. <clears throat> okay. All right then. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, there was something bothering me. It's it's gone now. Usually it's me, but I'm still around. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> All right. Video go in three, two, one, go. Ah, yes. Welcome back to Destiny. The last of the three. What does it mean to be a hunter? I say it's all about where you belong. The warlocks have their libraries. Titans have their walls. But hunters belong in the wilds. Out there, you want to live, you better have a quick shot or a sharp blade. A lot of us are loners, but that's not the only path. Some of us know the difference a fire team makes. Some of us, we touch the void, make it a part of us. And then we take a name, Night Stalker. Hunt from the shadows, pin them down, never let them see you coming. You know how the Stormcaller and the Sunbreaker are both kill everything kind of kind of kind of classes. Mm-hmm. The Night Stalker is not. Tebis is our most experienced Night Stalker. We can't afford to lose him. Plus, you know, he's an old friend. Owes me money. For the audience, you don't know what to expect. Well, some do, some don't. No, but, no, yeah. no. <laughs> this so, is the most obscure indie game. Definitely. Um, so, I don't know exactly what happened, but I didn't capture the footage for actually accepting the quest, but we're tracking down one of Cade's old uh, gambling buddies, who also happens to be a Void Hunter. Of course it'd be a, a gambling buddy of Cade's. What else oh, would yeah. it be? <laughs> That you? Cade? Good that I can't smell your breath. Listen. Do robots have Cade, breath? My ghost is still That's what I was thinking. Well, he's in a great mood. See if you can find It's not like he's a cyborg, he's just he's a full on robot, so um Yeah, yeah that's what? weird. It's weird. That's some weird writing, that's to say. Maybe they had lived it. Maybe. So, I am using a hand cannon. Um, Ooh, actually, fun! <laughs> interesting note. And yes, I, I do believe this would actually be interesting for those of you in the know. This, uh, this hand cannon is called the Devil You Know. Very similar mm. name to a very similar item in, well, the second game. Yeah. If you've done any form of... PPP at all, you may have come across it even. Mm hmm. A thousand times. By pretty much everybody. Mm hmm. So, yeah. Fighting yet more Vex. Expansion's called the Taken King, but we've been fighting Vex. Basically, the entire time <laughs> so far. Why do I feel like the Vex have, um,. Like, we're basically stealing technology from the Vex, even though we aren't. Why are the Vex so involved with these new classes? I don't know, actually. That's a very good question. Hmm. I mean, there are those theories that people throw around in Destiny 2 about the infinite forest, but I don't pay any heed to that. I'll have to remind Python after this video, apparently, because he doesn't remember. Right. I don't remember. And it's not just abstaining from commenting. Yeah. Mm. Python has a terrible memory. Oh, yes. Clearly. <laughs> so I feel and, I did... And bad aim. I feel... Actually, I was just about to say, I feel I did really well with my aim in this video. I was hitting crits at left and right, except for like uh, that last wave there. Yeah. That was a lot of shit. The one I decided to uh, focus on and comment oh, on. Yeah. 
I'm picking right? up the origin point of the broadcast. It's. I th I'm coming to believe ghost. that this is your true purpose for agreeing to do this. Right. Let's hope Tavis is still kicking. You get to talk about Python's aim. Of course it is. <laughs> Davis, if you can hear us, we're getting telemetry through your ghost. The vets are attacking quicker and quicker. I got no ghost, and they're both at short on light. We can use the gate in the Valley of Kings to get him out. Let's go. Guardian, I've been trying to raise Tevis. He won't answer. Either he's in over his head, or... Well, look, that guy owes me a lot of glimmer, so, uh... He better still be kicking. Alive or the other thing, we need to find Tavis. There aren't a lot of Night Stalkers in the field. We can't afford to lose his connection with the Void to the Vex. Go get him. Tevis is a cheat. And a liar. And he smells like a barrel of thrall spit. But he's our cheat. The Vex can't have him. How have they ever smelt oh. Thrall Spit? No. Look, alright, these robots... They have... They Does have it, tits, alright. The, the robots, robots, they have tits. Do they have a sense of smell, though? Assumably? But for what reason? I don't know. <laughs> it's... <laughs> I just don't know. So fucking weird. I, 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 I'm not entirely sure that Bungie completely thought out the EXO. I don't think they fully thought out... Like, the dialogue. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure oh, that's um, fine. They're used to dealing with main characters that don't speak, so... Yeah. Uh, that, well, uh, that LMG I'm using, we've seen it before, it's, it's Nova Mortis again. Exotic. Thing. Makes you more dead. Makes them more dead. Should call it Nova More Dead. Tevis is gone, <laughs> but the light in his bow still burns. And yes, I realize Mortis, Mortis is, is something to do with death in Latin. You're wrong. Yeah, yeah, I know. I was, I was going to comment on it, but I was like, yeah, I'll let it slide. That was more for the okay. thread's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so here we go. We now have the power of the Shadow Shot. Power of the Void. So, I did mention that the Sunbreaker and Stormcaller are both more killy killy kind of supers. Night Stalkers? No. Night Stalkers are more support. See, oh, Shadow Shot. Yeah, go ahead. go ahead. So, Shadow Shot, you fire a tether, or you fire an anchor, which tethers enemies to it, which disorients them, and uh, and it increases the damage you deal against tether targets. Like, makes everything a crit. They've, they've changed it in between the first and second game. Oh, okay, I was going to say, because in the second game, it's much different, because it makes every enemy tethered share damage. Right. That's that's not the case here, unfortunately. But it does right. really well regardless because, you know, the disorientation factor itself is pretty much enough. Yeah, uh, it's really, really good in Destiny 2. In fact, it's the only thing people run in PvP and PvE for a Hunters. Obviously, you know, um, the... Golden Gun Marksman? Uh, 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 shit. Gunslinger, yeah. Yeah, the Gunslinger is great for DPS against bosses, but it's... for everything else, Shadow Shot is just so much better. Yeah, it's it's very situational. Hmm. So, uh, I'd also like to call attention to the melee, which is not actually just a melee. You, you, you throw a smoke bomb. And uh, you can spec the smoke bomb to do several different kinds of things. You can use it to make yourself invisible. You can use it to disorient the enemies further. You know, 
Yeah, basically, basically you are just a full-on support class in a game that does not really have support classes in, in right. the traditional MMO sense. So, you know, there's no tank, there's no healer, there's no anything like that. Yeah. It's interesting. And it I is really actually like quite it. fun to play. Yes, yes, it is. I'll be honest, Guardian. I wasn't sure you could connect with the Void. It's always a challenge. I should have known better. We may have lost Tevis, but your strength means the Vanguard still owns the night. Come on back. Yeah, there it is. But we also get to choose what we want to see. Mm -hmm. uh, the thread will have the details within this post, so... Fire one off for our homie. Yeah. Who? Hey.